it was a beautiful day for some students to spend some time outside of the classroom, running, jumping, and throwing their way into first, second, and third places. Yeah, mighty nice weather and just a great start to the weekend. The Columbia County Special Olympics at Greenbrier High School today, and students with special needs got a chance to shine and have a lot of fun. News Channel 6's Renetta Dubose spent the day there, and she joins us now live in the newsroom with what that day means for some parents. Jenny, I pulled three mothers aside today raising children with autism and like the events their children face today, sometimes the journey can be a challenge, but it's one they say is uniquely beautiful. They have a chance to um, get out and be with other children who have disabilities. Get set. Students took off in the 100 meter dash. While supporters are there to cheer them on at the finish line, Greenbrier High School football field transformed into Columbia County Special Olympics, where students with special needs not only ran, but competed in seven events, including softball throw and running long jump. That's where Riverside Middle School's Chase performed. His mother says he has autism, and raising a son with it can be challenging. Worrying about his future, worrying about what he'll do when he's out of school and as we age as parents. 12-year-old Harmony participated too. She's in the autism program at Riverside Middle as well, where her mother is already working in the community to bring parents of children with autism together for support. There's a program called Katie Beckett program where um, your child can get a medical attention through um, the states. That's one of the things, if I didn't know about it, until I got turned down for, for other things, and I had to learn on, on my own. Learning is something the mother of twins, Paris and Peyton Andrews, is doing too. Born at just 24 weeks, Paris has autism, and Peyton does not. Autism is a beautiful, unique puzzle for a reason. So it's not for us to generalize every person with autism and not to underestimate their abilities. They are smart, they are intelligent, they are full of personality. April recognizes autism awareness, and Harmony's mom planned a fashion show for children like hers to feel special. Autism children are not weird. They are not strange. They are some very lovable children. They are very talented. The Defying Autism Odds Fashion Show takes place Saturday, April 14th. To learn more about it, visit WJBF.com and click on this story. Back to you.